him. Oh! I can't knock that shield down. <laughs> come on, come on, come on! Boom! No! Yes! Okay, so it's Thursday and that means it is Dreamhangers time. So we're going to take a look at the first comment here uh, coming from Gamer Guys. And uh, this is going to be a very interesting one. It's Corpix Sonic Suggested Builds. Now, if you guys have ever gone into the description of your robots, it has, um, you know, at the bottom, suggested builds for that robot. This is basically the whole theme here. Uh, we've got the Fenrir, Shell, Orc, Ravana, Phantom, and also the Arthur. Not sure how this is going to go, but we're going to try it out. And as you can see, we've got the Fenrir here with Glory and Storm. I think, you know, these weapons used to be good. Um, the Glory isn't that bad, but the Storm right now, not that great. <laughs> so, yeah, it's going to be interesting to see how I'm going to do with this hangar. Um, we have the Shell with Nucleon and Quarker. Okay, I'm not sure who at Pixonic is coming up with these suggested builds, but this is definitely not one that I would run. I think they need to hire me uh, to give them suggested builds here. Uh, this Hawk one, not that bad actually. Uh, Ember with Blaze. And I'm not sure what you guys think of these builds. Um, I guess it was good when it, you know, came out, uh, the robot that is. Uh, we've got uh, the Ravana with Cryo. Interesting. Okay, so, <laughs> you know what? The more I look at these builds, I mean, come on, man. The Phantom with Pulsar and Marquise. It's so funny because they give us these builds and players tend to run the opposite of it. So, yeah. And then we have the Arthur here with the Saw and Rupture. Now, I don't typically run this build because sometimes these weapons don't uh, register. So you can only imagine how bad <laughs> we're going to do with this hangar. But very interesting concept. And uh, well, that's my hangar. So let's jump into the first game here. And let's see how we do with these suggested builds. Okay, so game one, we have dropped in on Dreadnought map. I have started with the Phantom first. Um, hmm. <laughs> I'm not sure how this uh, hangar is going to go. I already played one game and man, this hangar is terrible. I can take out maybe a Favni or something that would be nice. Oh wait, we're doing some damage. Uh -oh, uh -oh. Guys, I need some help quick. Let's try to target this guy. Going to use my um, my ability there only because it gives me resistance. Uh, he's gone into flight now, which is less than ideal. Oh, come on. This guy's shooting me. Heal. Oh, man. My last hand almost. Almost. Just reload. Um, hmm. You know what? I'm going to go for center. This guy's going to teleport to me. We're going to do this so he teleports off the edge. There we go. Try to help out the guys on this side. I need to target this... Uh, that Favnir. Can I get him? There's no ways I'm going to take these guys out. <laughs> Can't forget about that. Oh, come on! Okay, um, let's see. We're going to drop in next with... Let's use the Ravana. I'm trying to get rid of my, my weaker bots here. Uh-oh. What is this guy up to? He's being all sneaky. Oh, jeez. There's so many players on this side. I'm trying to see if I can perhaps hit that player there. Um, oh, my gosh. We got to get going quick. I can't hit this guy. Nope. Let's put that shield down. We are kind of changing it. Sort of. Get him with the splash maybe. Come on. Ugh. Yes. We got a kill. More like uh, stole that kill. But, you know, when you're running a, a build like this, <laughs> everything counts. Can I get that play up? Oh, jeez. Basically, using this to run beacons is what I'm doing. They're gonna get the they're gonna get the left side back. 
Yeah, let's see. We can try to heal up. Oh, jeez. Thing is, I don't have any more rockets here. That did some damage. Trying to uh, save my rocket so I can do some damage to these guys. There we go. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. There we go. I think I'm gonna get killed here. Okay, we got this beacon. Oh! <laughs> this guy's behind. Yes! Knock that shield down. I think this is gonna be a crazy game. I have a feeling. Like, I know we are leading on the beacon bar, but I have a feeling these guys are going to start making an aggressive push here. I can't hit this player yet. Hold on. No! Oh! Where is he? That's going to do it. Oh, come on! <laughs> I'm actually getting... Players down to their last end. I'm gonna get totally wiped out here. Um, I'm gonna sacrifice this, I think. Okay, let's sacrifice the Ravana. We have a lot of bots left here. I'm really curious to see how the shell's gonna do because some players have told me that they think Pixonic might have uh, buffed these weapons. Silently buffed them. Okay, because they seem to be doing more damage. I'm not sure if that's true. Guess we're gonna find out. Hmm. Oh no. Yeah. Oh jeez. <laughs> this guy's gonna kill me. There's no ways. I mean, actually, we're kind of doing decent damage. He's going to break my shield, though. Oh, wait. He's going to go in a flight, I think. Trying to do damage to him. Trying to mess up his aim. What did I say? Look at look at the uh, the beacons. These guys are actually starting to come back here. <laughs> he, can't, he can't aim at me. Put the shield down. Come on, guys. Help me out here. He lost a weapon, yes! He's gonna kill his bot. Yes! Uh-oh. Maybe they did buff these uh, weapons, I'm not sure. They seem to be doing a bit more damage. But I haven't run these weapons in a while, so I'm not sure. I'm trying to get this side. Ah! Yes! Uh-oh, uh-oh. Okay, we got that guy. Okay, this is gonna be another problem here. This guy's got a T-Falcon. Maybe I can push him. Let's do that. Ugh. Trying to think what bot I'm gonna drop in with uh, next. I think I stayed in that Ravana too long. Okay, wait, hold on a second here. He's trying to get really close. I don't know if that's a good idea. My blast. Come on. Kill him. <laughs> He's gonna kill me. Come on. My last stand has triggered. But he's close enough for the blast. Boom. Oh. I can't knock that shield down. <laughs> come on. Come on. Come on. Boom. No. Yes. Got him! <laughs> it was so worth it. Okay. Let's drop in with the Fenrir. Maybe I can defend the center. We're doing... I mean, this is a pretty close game. Look at the beacon bar. I might have to show gameplay of the Arth and also uh, that Hawk. Let's see how we do against this Revenant. Um, hold on. Let's do that now. There we go. We got a kill with it. 
They have two players left. Three players. Whoa, what is that? Uh oh. Okay, wait, that. I don't know if I want to go. Okay, let's just go into this mode. Maybe we can lock him or something. Uh oh. Trying to block the way here. Not firing because he has a shield. Now we fire. Yes! <laughs> All things considered, we're actually doing pretty decent. Okay, so I didn't get to play the Hawk and also the Arthur. So I'm going to show you a gameplay of that. And then we'll take a look at the next dream hangup. So how did we do in this game? Let's see. 4.6 million, 8 kills, 7 beacons. And this is how we stacked up. I have to use my heal just in case. Oh, there we go. Oh, jeez. I think that was a mistake. He shouldn't have done that. I'm going to go into flight. Quickly. Oh, man. My last stand was triggered. I did not want that at all. So I'm going to try to focus this guy down. Then I'm going to use my heal. There we go. I was trying not to get my last stand triggered. Unfortunately, it got triggered. Let's move this way. I'm trying to wait until I have at least my ability here. Okay, we're going to try to move uh, into the uh, center. Let me just reload first. Always make sure that you are reloaded before you engage. Okay, let's go in a flight. Take this guy out. That guy out. And this one. Wait a minute. Isn't this the same guy that tried to kill me earlier? I think so. He's going straight for me. Uh oh. We gotta melt him. Quickly! Yes! Um. Maybe that guy. I think this weapon needs like more rockets or something. Oh, come on. No. <laughs> I was hoping the splash would hit him. Let's try to get that player. And steal it. Oh, man. There was a bit of lag there, but I got it. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. This guy's in trouble. Hold on, dude. Hold on. Death fought. I'm gonna sit on his head. Let's use the shield. Oh man, I'm trying to save him. <laughs> trying to block the way here. So they can't get to this Nodens. This guy's trying to get to the Nodens. I'm trying to block his way. Oh, come on. No! Yes! You shall not pass! Okay, so let's take a look at the next dream hanger here coming from Zach. And Zach is saying that he is running this on his own account. We've got the Favnir, Erebus, Hawk, Urachi, Revenant, Luchador. And it looks like he's saving up uh, for the Nebula. So as you can see, we've got the Favnir here with scatty weapons. Uh, here are the uh, modules and pilot skills. I think overall, this hanger is looking pretty solid. Um, we have the Erebus here with Hell. This build's really good at taking out Favnirs too. Okay, and then we have the uh, Hawk with the uh, Incinerator, Skull, and Iku. I could kind of see this working. Um, just my own personal preference here. I would have preferred like Incinerator and Skull instead of using the Iku shield. The only time I use the Iku shield is when I know I need to get really close to the enemy. And uh, with these weapons, you have 500 meter range. So I don't think it's really necessary to have that. Um, you have the Arachi with Bane. So a very powerful build here. Um, I think you are running the eye on here. And um, you know the nebula works really good uh, for the Arachi. But also uh, for this next build. Uh, the Revenant with Devastator and Toxin weapons. Now I have run a couple of games uh, with this. Just to kind of get an idea of you know how this would do. One thing I'm finding. So uh, the Toxin weapons are firing. And you know once I fight all my shots with the Devastator. There's that long reload time. So I think for me, I would have preferred uh, maybe a Bane or even an Ember, I think works better. Or even the Puncher. Okay, so that might be something worth considering. 
we've got the luchador here with vengeance uh, cinder and retaliator i'm assuming you're going for something like vengeance and cinder or maybe a uh, grom and cinder in the end so uh, this is the modules and uh, yep we're gonna jump into a game to see how we do with zach's dream hangar okay so game two we have dropped in on factory map i have started with the arachi first here oh man that guy has qr are you kidding me look how fast i went down to my last stand the thing is you know this build i don't have any resistance which is really bad because um you know i'm fighting close range here this guy's gonna kill me at least we have the beacon but it's only temporary so i got totally smoked um we're gonna drop in next with the erebus these guys have a lot of farvnias back there Yep. Oh, i think i did emp that player there's another one moving down this way i wonder if i can stop him Okay, we locked that guy in place. Uh, there is another player over there we want to target. This guy, I think. Yeah, that's the Favnir. Can we get him? Ugh. He's going to go into flight soon. I have to keep my distance here. Let's try to target that player. Don't shoot the shield! <laughs> oh man, that guy's shooting. Oh wait, he has shield breaker. Yeah, if you have shield breaker, it's a different story. Uh oh. We're gonna move this way. This guy's gonna get that beacon. Yeah, last stand on him. There we go. And this guy. Can we get him? Yes! Let's move this way. We have a few players on this left flank. Probably want to protect it. What does this guy have here? Oh, Arachi. Let's try to get him. Got him. Nice. And that guy. Here we go. I think they're going to push this flank here. So I'm going to move this way. We need to weaken this guy's shield up. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Scorpion. Uh-oh. Scorpion. Oh, jeez. So that's one thing with the Erebus. It's not like the Typhon. You know, with the Typhon, you, uh, as long as your Aegis shield is up, that guy got me with the Monarch. As long as your Aegis shield is up with the Typhon, you can block like blast uh, damage. With the Erebus, it goes all the way through. So you don't have that luxury. You need to stop this player here. Try to get him with that corrosion. Ah, that's doing some nice damage. I gotta turn sideways. That guy has puncher weapons. Oh, jeez. Orbital strikes. Maybe I can teleport to them. Okay, I'm teleporting. So I'm not firing at this guy because his uh, shield was up. Uh, he's lagging a bit here. So you see what I'm doing? I'm trying to fire where I think he's going to go. I can lead that target. So he's now down to his last stand. But they have a titan. <laughs> I'm going to get smoked. Come on, get him. Quickly. Ah! Come on. Yes, I got him. I got him, guys. I got him. <laughs> I ended up going down. Okay, we're gonna use the we're gonna use the hawk next. That looks like what is that? An Arthur or something here? That might be yeah, that's an Arthur. There we go. And this guy. 
These guys are going to push our beacon on this, uh, the center. Oh, we lost. Wait a minute. We're losing all our beacons. I got locked. Guys, left side. Oh, jeez. I got to move this way. <laughs> we need to scramble here. Oh, wait. Can't hit that player. Let's get this player down to his last stand. Oh, hold on. We locked, uh, we locked that Favnir. Yep, that didn't work. I got hit by the, uh, the orbital strike. So I guess that's one other reason why I would rather use weapons than the, uh, the EQ shield. Oh, jeez. I should have used, like, shield break on here, I think. It'll take out this guy. Try to help out over there. Uh -oh. ah! Rockets! <laughs> oh my gosh. I guess it's working here. The EQ shield. Somewhat. This guy's gonna kill me. Oh my gosh! I need to go to flight quick! Oh man, I couldn't. <laughs> okay, we have the Luchador next. It's becoming a battle of titans now. And after this, I have the Favnir, so it looks like I am going to be running through pretty much all my bots here. I do have to be careful of the, um, the Miramets on that side. Oh, jeez. Ah! <laughs> he EMP'd me. He should have done that first, actually, I think. Oh man, there's another guy here that can EMP me. Oh man, that was a... You know what? I don't think I should have jumped into that mess. Maybe we can get these guys. No! Yes! This guy? Yes! Focusing th down that guy instead of this other one here behind me because they have that mirror mitts. He's gonna hit me with the... E yeah, he hit me with the EMP. Oh man! We gotta jump. And coming! Boom! Oh, there was this guy here. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> Everyone's hitting me. Yes! Another one! Man, I got EMP'd again. Wow. So, I wasn't able to play that Favnir. So, I'm going to include that gameplay. And uh, this is how I did in that game. And there we go. Try to help out here. These guys have a lot of shells. Wow. There we go. And this guy. Can I get him? There we go. I'm going to move to the uh, right side. Let's try to hit this guy here. What is that? A Mender? No, that's an Orochi. Uh-oh, he's coming this way, but I have to also stop this player here. He's going to be right on this beacon. Let's deal with him first. And another one. Whoa, my last stand almost got triggered. That was close. Put down this heal. I can take out that player as well. There we go. Right side, guys. Right side. Taking out this Revenant. Um, he might have lost connection or something. He was standing still. That Orochi. There we go. So thank you very much to Gamer Guys and to Zach for your dream hangers. I hope you guys enjoyed the gameplay of them. And once again, to everyone else, if you would like a chance to be featured in a future dream hangers video, make sure to post your dream hangers in the comment section down below. And don't forget, guys, if you enjoyed this video, Make sure to check out the rest of this Dreamhanger series by going to Playlist and finding Dreamhangers. We have over 100 episodes, um, a lot of fun, different themes, and also I try to help out players with their hangers just like this episode. Make sure to check it out, and I think that's pretty much it. So thank you guys for watching, and until the next video, I'll catch you guys later.